Galaxy Buds. Galaxy Earbuds or just Buds? Earbuds. Galaxy Buds. I think it's True Galaxy. Wireless. True Wireless Galaxy Buds. <laughs> You remember our Galaxy phone, oops, do you, do you remember our Galaxy <laughs> S10e not... review? And we decided to get these earbuds. Here is what we like and what we don't like about it. What I like about that personally is that they really, really fit well in my ears. And it might well be because my ears are funny because the AirPods from the iPhone constantly fall out. What do you like about them? The, the Verge actually call them the first forgettable wireless earphones, yeah. which means that you put them in and you completely forget that you've gotten them in. Yeah, so, okay, that's a good point because I had them in yesterday and I was basically not realizing, going around the house and say, Tony, Tony, check this out. What do they look like? And she said, what? I can't see anything. <laughs> I said, you look like you've got a hearing aid. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a different story, right? Design is a different story. Wireless charging has got some kind of magnetic thing in here. So when you put them back in, they basically stick in there. It really comes down to what is it for and who is it for? I think it can only be used for the latest Android version as well as the Samsung Galaxy S10, right? Yeah. So we put it to the test. It's obviously the wireless charging works on the other side of the phone, on the back side. You do have an application on your Samsung phone in there you can kind of can adjust basic settings for equalizer you have dynamic settings bus boost treble boost and all of this however i found that there's only certain music that kind of sound good and when you as soon as you start listening to hip-hop these are just not the ones i think there could have been so much more right from from the principle the idea of it is perfect you kind of you open it up it pairs immediately you can adjust it internally you have the ambient sound settings you have touch control the sound quality is just not there. When you can obviously do the comparison between the Apple. The AirPods, yeah. For you and the type of music that you play, yeah. does the Apple do better or is it just a I case only of... listen to classical music. So. <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. Oh, they're all wet now. Going back to the Samsung Galaxy buds. <laughs> no, you can't lick them. The idea is top notch. The way it's been done is also good. The way they stick in your ear is good. I'm not the biggest fan of the touch controls. I've, that's got nothing to do with the Samsung. I reviewed the Surface headphones, yeah. the Microsoft Surface headphones the other day, and they have like dials. Buttons are made for a reason, let's be honest. These touch controls don't work really well. Well, I would say personally, I'm probably not the best person. DJ, stop it now. I'm probably not the best person to do this. I took them out, and the first thing I looked at was the end of them. And if you think about the AirPods, they're all just, Oops. it's just, <laughs> we are so Oops. failing She's gone. today. <laughs> She's here. The AirPods are one piece of plastic yeah. that you put in your ear. Right. The reason why it's being designed like that is because it sticks in your ear as well. Put it this way, if they would sound like the AirPods, then I think they wouldn't be bad because you can just put them in and they wouldn't fall out. Live testing. <laughs> testing. Wait, it, so, actually, everything's yeah. every, immediately yeah. muffled. Yeah. You could use them for sleeping. Okay. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> They're designed to travel, right? For traveling, for going on the airplane, okay. blocking out that outside sound. That's well, I hadn't designed. put them in my ears before and I didn't yeah. want to because of the way they looked. These would be perfect for going on a long distance flight there you go. when you want to listen to something while you're falling asleep. Yeah. Maybe you can put whale sounds on or ocean yeah. sounds or something. That's a good idea. Then put some techno music. <laughs> <laughs> no, or a, an audio book. That's a good idea, audio book. That's or a, a good, podcast. Because you, yeah, you have the option and the equalizer to adjust your kind of voice sound. And she listens to my podcasts all the time on a regular basis. <laughs> I would put full the... disclosure, I don't have any podcasts. <laughs> <laughs> I, actually, I'm really surprised because I didn't like the look of them, but as soon as you put them in, they're actually really comfortable. Yeah. They yeah. are more comfortable than the hard yeah. AirPod. You can go parachuting with them and they stick in your ears for sure. So that's how, how solid they feel in your ears. I would give it a three star out of five. And the only reason why I would give it three stars instead of two stars is because of the design, USB-C, the, the wireless charging. You put, can put it on the back of your Galaxy phone and have it charged there. I think it's a cool feature. Easy setup, you have an equalizer, but the sound quality brings 
brings it all down to an For average. You. Yes, because let's face it, they cost one hundred and thirty dollars, right? So put that into so perspective. How pounds. much are the AirPods? One sixty-ish. So they're around the same. They're around the same. If you would, fact if, that you, if you would have one hundred and thirty, if I had one hundred and thirty dollars, would you buy I'm them? At... Yes or no? No. No. Okay, you would spend it on what? AirPods. AirPods. Okay. Even though they look ridiculous. And they fall out when you move. They don't fall out for me. Well, you may because you you're just smaller. Yes. <laughs> I would not buy these because I am not in the Samsung ecosystem. Yeah. If I were to use them with anything else, I can lose yeah. functionality. There uh, have been reported issues of Bluetooth connectivity with mm -hmm. other Android devices. Yeah. So would I invest that if I weren't an S10 user, then no. No. If I were okay. an S10 user, then probably yes, because you're in the ecosystem. Yeah. Everything works together nicely. So we went down a rabbit hole there of our own ideas of what a bud or earbud should be if you were using an s10 as your daily driver would you use these <sighs> <laughs> you want to say yes for the review don't you do you know the term yain it's a german <laughs> ja and nein that means yes and no combined and so the conclusive answer would be 50 50. what would crazy. put you off the most the quality because i'm a i'm an audio You're a nerd. Bass, yeah. yeah i need my bass i need the audio i love good audio and that would really put me personally off what do you think about the galaxy samsung earbuds do you have any experience let us know do you like them let us know do you like the color black let us know do you like yellow or white better let us know have you got a samsung galaxy s10e let us know let us know in the comments below we may do a giveaway if you stick with our channel do they come in different colors they come in different colors yellow all wasn't right. available <laughs> yellow was not but you available. don't want yellow in your ears but i don't know it may look good yellow wasn't available is yellow black and white currently available officially but we could only get black currently so let us know what you think we'll do a poll as well whether yeah. you would choose these over yeah. something else don't forget to like comment share share the love share the love always share the love hit the like or dislike button whatever you feel like and if you like dj subscribe what's your channel tony the car geek we're getting there see you next time <laughs> jensie from also space comment like subscribe bye see you later